you start seeing testosterone decrease. You start seeing, you know, it's some weight gain, you would think some that depression. That, that would uh, reduce the prostate cancer potential and well, yet, it, yet it's good going point. the other way. Well, that's because prostate cancer is dependent on estrogen receptor beta. So there's alpha and beta. There's two estrogen receptors, right? Mm, the androgen so, receptor is the big mediator of prostate cancer. Eh. Oh, please. I do research <laughs> in that area. Well, that's what most of the research is So there's at. one androgen receptor, mm-hmm. right? So whereas with estrogen, there's two receptors. There's mm-hmm. estrogen receptor alpha and estrogen receptor beta. A lot of the health problems come from the estrogen receptor alpha activation in terms of prostate cancer, at least in cells. Um, in fact, beta is probably protective. So things like licorice root, right, they preferentially activate your estrogen receptor beta. Mm-hmm. Um, and that seems to be protective against prostate cancer. So most of the time when people are out looking for uh, drugs that are protective for prostate cancer. Well, mostly lowering testosterone will be protective. Well, I mean. So maybe other factors. Who knows? Well, so my question we would be why, why wouldn't things. teenagers have a lot of prostate cancer? I don't know much about this topic. Why would they? Why wouldn't teenagers be getting prostate cancer? Their testosterone is the roof. Right. It's, <clears throat> it's not enough time, not enough time of exposure and whatever genetic mechanisms are turning on and off through time. Okay, so you're saying bodybuilders and people that are doing TRT have no. There actually is it's 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 not associated. Increasing testosterone doesn't cause prostate cancer. It can reactivate meta- metastases. We sure. think and it cases, can't cause so. prostate cancer. Low testosterone does reduce prostate cancer activity. So lowering it sh- at least would delay the onset or would delay the maybe the in the progressiveness. People would be presenting later. That sort of thing. Yeah, and I wonder, well, I wonder if that's a, in big part, a large part, to aromatization of testosterone. In other words, if your levels are high, you're getting aromatization, you're, which is creating estradiol, which is activating estrogen receptor alpha. Again, I'm not a super expert on this Again, topic. Lowering levels reduces. So then lowering levels would yeah. reduce that aromatization, yeah. reducing, oh. thereby reducing estrogen. Uh, it all seems to be mediated through the androgen receptor. 